Stone Titan. Ed Stone returning here to Wildcat Sports. Talk about two of the hottest young athletes to come out of the Wildcat Sports Dojo. I mean, look at the physique on this guy. Ed Stone is literally chiseled out of marble. One of the finest stones out there, Sammy. Sometimes we see Ed Stone here at Wildcat Sports. He's a proud member of the House of Harbor. And of course, Dave Bradley is running with the Chris Cruz and the International Players Club. They're both of them going alone here tonight. Obviously, Stone has left the House of Harper and is looking to see what challenge awaits him next here at Wildcat Sports. And obviously, both of these men like to put championship all around their waist, but they gotta get things started here first. Here, kicking things off for Wildcat for life. Look at that. Tonight. And look at that strength already. Immediately. Stone already taking position as the man in charge because we're sitting here ringside. Of course, I'm sitting against once of David Powers. And now, hard by the Chris Harper. Hey. Does at the announce table. I was Harper. stuck in the bathroom. I went to El Paso's earlier. Sorry. Harper, I know you've you got to be familiar with Dave Bradley at this point, but you're very familiar with that Stone, former yes. member of the House of Harper. That's right. One thing I love about Stone, he is a 100% pure athlete. He's not just a gym rat like some people around here. This kid played football for Nickel State. And just Look at that strength, oh my God, just pouncing Nate Bradley away. Uh, you see why you have uh, Stone here at Boy Harper. Yes. You can still see this upside of Stone, even though he's Look at the physique on him. Who, who has a better physique than Stone? Well, look, Chris, that's why he decided he had to get out of the cheap house. The house of Harper's days of producing champions seem to be long gone as people are out on the shelf or just... Well, he champions. went to Houston. Oh, look at that! Look at that. Stan Hester's in the drop kick, but not enough to take Stone off his feet. And look at nice! That. Look at that! What I a mean, leap. wow! At, how could you let a prospect like that leave your house, Harper? How could you not hold on to something like that? Like I said, pure athlete, and he just displayed that just now. I don't think Nate Bradley or that Stone have ever been in better shape right now. And it's very interesting to see if this. I was gonna say power versus speed, but the speed that Stone's already pulling yes. this play. But Nate Bradley looking for something toe based to see if he's outside. Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh -oh. Stone caught. Nate Bradley in midair, and oh, this is not good for Bradley. Goodness. Hexes is taking the momentum. Stone goes right, crashing into that ring post on the outside. And now Nate Bradley looking for something. Mr. Oh Fox my Crashing into Stone on the outside. Nathan Bradley, he's showing no fear. He's not intimidated whatsoever by Stone. Look, Nathan Bradley's taking a lot of risks. I'm not sure his body can take it. Edwin Stone, you can beat him, throw him around. Well, here's him. the thing. If, if, if Nathan Bradley is going to defeat someone like Stone, he's going to have to take some rest. Nathan Bradley up on the top rope. There's a cross body, but again, got caught by the Stone Titan. Points him up with ease. And he'll There's pay for that wrist drop. right there. And that might be all she wrote. Right into the cover, hooks the leg. And what? Not enough to keep Mr. 5K down, but... Talk about a five-tool player. Stone has all of the gifts you need yes. to be a champion in this business. He's won titles all over, including the former Wildcat Revolution champion in his own right. I believe that Stone would love to get his, champ his hands back nice. on that championship. And Nate Bradley trying to create some separation, but it looks like that might have just uh, oh. annoyed Ed Stone more than anything. Oh. I mean, we're talking about effectiveness and ineffectiveness. Plain and simple. Another cover here. Bobby Black right down and another one cover. Nate Bradley showing a lot of tenacity here. Nate Bradley has made a name for himself in the tag team division. Of course, former member of Fortune 5000, lately the team with Chris Cruz and the International Players Club. But you got to believe Nate looking to maybe make a name for himself in singles competition. He was able to get a victory over Stone here tonight. The guy, I believe he would be making his way up the ladder here at Wildcat, but I, oh, wow. look, look at that. With the float over. Maintains control, my God. Yeah, look at that. What control? Nice headbutt. 
by Stone. Stroll, Cranium, good night, Mr. Bradley. Thank you for coming. Stone, and look at that dead lift. That's Trenton right Stone being displayed once again. Nothing but raw power from the Stone Titan. Another cover from Stone. And this has all been Stone Titan so far. Well, is that surprising? Look at this guy. Lacked any capacity, he was experienced, but he gets that match after match, night after night, show after show. Yes, sir. He's shown he's grown so much in the strategy so far here at Wildcat Sports. This is the last time we saw him. Now, Nate Bradley desperately needs to get some separation. Isn't going to find the RC. Look at those marks on the back of Nate Bradley. Battle with Stone. As a measure, but have to use that quickness. Just like that goes Rich. Oh, I thought it was going to be a cover. Went to the double stop. Goodness. And look at that standing oh, shooting star press. Is that enough? No, two count only. No, it wasn't enough. It looks beautiful, but it's not effective. It's not enough force. There's not enough meat on Bradley to take down a guy like Ed Stone. Beautiful, but devastating offense for Mr. 5K, but not enough to crumble the Stone Titan, but Stone caught him up nice. and goes down Bradley. It's like a choke slam. How hot do you think Nathan Bradley got with that? And the Raptors here at Crescent City, and still again only two. And now finally frustration starting to show on the face of Ed Stone here. I can't believe uh, Nathan Bradley kicked out from that. Like the, both these men, both these men came up through the Wildcat Dojo, know each other so very well. Now Nate Bradley positioned on that top rope by the Stone Titan. Gotta believe that Edge is gonna take this up a notch, which cannot spell anything good. For Mr. 5K. He's gonna break this poor man's back. Oh no. He's desperately trying to break out of this. Now slips through. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Unbelievable. Now just like that. Oh, caught in the face though. The awareness of both of these men. Oh my God, Stanley had scissors take Stone off. Good. I thought Stone was going to go airborne, but he went airborne the way that he didn't want to go. I can tell you that. Flying through the air with ease. Is there anything that Nate Bradley can't do? He can't be Edge Stone. I'm telling you, it's an impossibility. The physics are all off. This is still Edge Stone's match. He's just catching a little breather right now. Well, Nate is pulling out all the stops against the Titan here. Yikes. And oh, look, this relentless, high impact offense. Another drop kick connects. Oh, oh my nice. God, Dragon suplex high and tight on the neck. I don't believe it. I don't believe what I'm saying. Again, using that speed, charging in Nate Bradley again. Oh, connects to the noggin of Stone. Let's go. Goes up, springboard again, another drop kick. Finally takes Stone off his feet here. Ouch. Now can he roll him in position? Oh, bad landing, Stone on his stomach. Now, cover here. Uh, just that, that one second that it forced Nate to push Stone onto his shoulders. Great effort from Nate. But how impressed are you, David, by Ed Stone, the ring awareness to get to his stomach in that situation? Well, I mean, I'm not surprised at all. Ed Stone knows wrestling. Ed Stone knows every trick, every little thing that's gonna make him win. That's what makes him impossible. Tilt and roll action, nice. DDT! My goodness. Open up in. Come on, Ralph. Try to cover Nate with the cover. A little closer, see, Edgestone knows that if he gets to his stomach, he's gonna have that little extra strength taken out of his opponent. Wasn't able to get it that time, and it almost fell disaster. How much more does Nate have to throw at this Titan? Will this... The stone finally crumble here tonight to kick things off at Wildcat for life. 
Bradley looking for maybe a power bomb. Oh, look at that flips up and lands right on his feet. Up on the shoulders. Oh, no. Good night. That's, that's it. That's going to be it. Two. Our leg. And no! Oh, my God. I don't know, that seemed like a slow count. How does Nathan Bradley keep keep kicking out from what Stone is doing to him? The heart and desire of Nate Bradley. He's barely checked here, and he's staying in this fight. He's too dumb to quit, that's what's happening. Bradley again, nice! Clobber down with that clothesline. He's gonna end up with a Right here, that's gotta be all, and no oh again! God. Ed Stone's getting mad. I'm mad at the ref. Maybe Nathan Bradley is made out of stone. There's a frustration starting to build. What has Ed Stone got to do to keep Mr. 5K down? Devastating, oh look at that, just dead lifting. Nate Bradley off the apron here. And Nate, thankfully got it. Oh my God, springboard. Oh my God. Sunset, power bomb, that's what? it. He kicked out, he kicked out. What? That was only two and seven A's, he kicked out. Bogus, absolutely bogus. Well the referees count. Says that Nate Bradley just beat Ed Stone. Nate Bradley just put away the Stone Titans. You're right, David. I think that Stone might have gotten his shoulder off, but right after the three count, this match could have gone either way.